Not 7-7 is part of a diptych, two sculptures that were produced from the reclaimed mahogany handrail of a 19th century staircase. And it's a continuation of a project called the Lemnis Gates that began several years ago. And the Lemnis Gates are sculptures made from several flights of stairs of reclaimed handrail. The pieces of handrail are not altered, but reassembled in such a way that the spiral becomes a loop, kind of coiling up on itself and taking the shape of an imperfect mathematical infinity symbol. The handrail is an object molded specifically to fit into the palm of the hand, so it's based on human proportions and then extruded to architectural scale. And it's kind of the meeting point of a human body and the architecture of space. It acts as a um, mediator between the space and the body and guides the hand into three-dimensional space. I thought it was quite poetic to work with something that was made by hand a hundred years ago and spent a century interacting with other hands and then is remade by hand again to become something else. Um, the wooden surfaces of the hand rails are often altered by prolonged exposure to touch and they also collect microscopic bits of skin. So each sculpture carries the DNA of hundreds of people becoming a collective portrait of the absent human bodies who have come through the now demolished or repurposed houses. The infinity symbol has become identified with a variation of the Ouroboros, an ancient image of an alchemical snake eating its own tail, that has come to symbolize the infinite repetition of life and death cycles, the binary duality of existence, the theory of eternal recurrence through space and time. The miracle of the Lemnis Gate appears in Nabokov's poem Pale Fire, as the figure eight traced by bicycle tires on the sand alluding to the disappearing memories and evaporating outlines of half-remembered people.